Hi, I'm Terry Tucker, author of Sustainable Excellence, 10 Principles to Leading Your Uncommon and Extraordinary Life. Welcome to another edition of Sustainable Excellence Extras. Today, I'd like to talk with you about how volunteering for a cause or organization you believe in can actually enhance your skill set. Harvey McKay, the self-made Minnesota millionaire, believes that if you are successful, you should give something back to your community. My father told me at age 19 or 20 that 25% of your life should go back to your community, McKay said in an interview in Entrepreneur Magazine in 1993. Little did I know at the time that volunteerism also enhances your skill set. For example, volunteerism made me get up and give all those cancer and United Way speeches. Now I've become a fairly good public speaker. Volunteerism sometimes requires me to go out and ask for hundreds of millions of dollars and get a lot of doors slammed in my face but it's enhanced my selling skills. I've spent 40 years now with entrepreneurs, charities, or anyone who wanted help, McKay goes on. The best thing anyone can do is get involved in something as a volunteer. Quite simply, you have a better chance to be happy and successful. A growing number of other people are devoting a portion of their time and talent to helping others as well. For example, Suzette Brooks, a Harvard Law School graduate, got together with friends to start New York Cares, a clearinghouse that schedules volunteer work to fit the hectic careers of bankers, lawyers, and executives. We began in reaction against the slick benefits and galas we've been invited to, she said. The more than 3,000 volunteers of New York Cares have worked in homeless shelters, welfare hotels, soup kitchens, and in more than 200 agencies. Volunteering has become desirable and acceptable, says Brooks. There are a lot of young professionals who feel they are focusing much too much on themselves, their careers, or their clients. They want to give something back. Everybody has to do something, whether you have time or money or know-how or space, says former First Lady Barbara Bush. Today, you can no longer say, the drug problem worries me, or crime worries me, or illiteracy worries me. If it worries you, then you've got to do something about it. How do you feel about using your time and talents in a volunteer capacity to not only help others, but to improve your skills as well? Leave me a comment below about your thoughts on volunteerism. Also, please head over to motivationalcheck.com to get your daily dose of inspiration and motivation. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.